Hello, my name is Mr. Asprey, and today is a quick fire vectors question. Um, we have um, the points A and B, and we have position vectors given. Uh, it says P, uh, the point P lies on the straight line uh, through A and B. So, first thing I'm going to do is just draw um, a straight line like this. Uh, I'm going to call my origin here. Um, and let's imagine that A is this point here. Okay, so uh, I could draw my position vector uh, would look like this. Okay, and then what we need is we need for P to be placed such that, let's say we have B here, we need P to be placed so that the distance from A to P is equal to two times the distance from B to P. So it's got to be much closer to B uh, than to A. So I think this is going to do it right here. Uh, so if I put my P, if I put P there, then if that distance, let's say, is 1, then as long as this distance is twice as big, then that works. So that looks good to me. Okay. Uh, so what are we going to need? We're going to need the vector A to B, which we can calculate by doing uh, OB uh, minus OA like that. Now I like to do my vectors in a column method. Um, in this instance uh, B would be minus 4, 1, 1 and A would be 2, 4, 7 and this would give me a column of minus 6, minus 3, minus 6. Okay, lovely. So now because I said that this was two parts and that was one part if I want to find um, O to P, then what I would do is I would travel <clears throat> uh, down here, so that's O to A, and then I would need just to add on two thirds of A to B, because it's two parts out of three. So what I need to do here is O to A, which is, um, let's just write it out, so O to A uh, plus two thirds of A to B. Okay, great. So that would be um, two, four, seven plus two thirds of uh, A to B, which we said was minus three, minus six, minus three, minus six. Okay, great. Um, <clears throat> So let me just do that calculation uh, because two thirds of that will be minus four, minus two, and minus four. Um, we don't need the calculator today. So therefore, when I add these two together, I will get uh, minus two, I will get two, and I will get three. Um, but I must write it in the same form that the question gives the vectors in. So I must write it as minus two i plus 2j plus 3j, uh, 3k, like that, perfect. Okay, now um, noticing that there's a plural here, it says position vectors is very important because there is another solution to this problem. So let's figure out where else p could be um, in order to satisfy that condition. Uh, <clears throat> so all I need is I need that the line a, um, uh, a to P needs to be twice as big as P to B. So I could put it right here at the end, like that, because that way the line A to P is twice the line uh, B to P, which would just be this one. So that works out nicely. Um, so as long as um, if this, if we call this distance from A to B one, then this distance has to be exactly the same. So therefore, A to B, A to P is twice uh, B to P. Okay. Um, so let's get rid of uh, some working and then let's grab some space. Okay. So this time we to find um, O to P, I would do O to A. Uh, plus uh, two lots of A to B. Uh, so this will be um, two, four, seven plus two lots of minus six, minus three, minus six. 
which is 2, 4, 7, um, plus minus 12, minus 6, minus 12, which gives me minus 10, uh, minus 2, and minus 5. And again, I must write it in the same form that they are writing their vectors in. So minus 10i minus 2j minus 5k. Beautiful.